Hello, YouTube. Hello, YouTube friends. A couple of points today. Um, I wanted to talk about uh, Pat Condell, uh, uh, a guy that uh, that I just sort of found on YouTube. He's uh, sort of this, I guess is the way he's portrayed, is sort of this raving atheist. Um, but he does make some, he's almost like he would be like a a stand-up comedian or something, This like this... Uh, the stand-up comedian that is so controversial that he couldn't appear in public, but uh, he has a he has a video on waiting for Jesus and and uh, you know talking about if the apocalypse happens as Jesus is going to come out of the clouds and save us and put on a show and um, you know it's it's sarcastic but it's uh, um, one thing that's missing with Pat Condell though is. Uh, there's no lo it's a lot of sarcasm. There's not a love, a lot, a lot of love expressed. So, um, I would challenge Pat Condell to, to uh, put a little bit of love in his, uh, in his talks. Just yeah, give us a little Leo Buscalia or something. You know, just give us a. You know, it's just so. It's this one level of sarcasm all the time. It's so Pat, you're you're getting a little bit boring. Um, so I would like to to see you, to. Uh, Expand your horizons and give some of your uh, heartfelt um, feelings. Um, I think a lot of what uh, the ideas that Jesus talked about were loving and uh, you know hope and peace and you know and those are, those are good things. You can't just take that away from people. But although religion might be a faulty construct, it's it's also a motivator. So uh, just some things for Pat Condell to study there. Um, another thing I, I really, just a, as an aside, nothing to do with Pat Condell, but uh, uh, saw something on, uh, what was it, MSNBC last night on Ann Coulter, uh, and her she's uh, raving mad about this uh, Romney, uh, this Romney employee on the Romney campaign who, who, um, in a, a discourse, I believe, with Fox News, which should be friendly territory, she's saying that uh, touting Romney's Massachusetts health care, going into this weird diatribe about how that's superior, and then, you know, the, the MSNBC hosts, including uh, Rachel Maddow, are laughing about it, saying, you know, and then uh, Ann Coulter is saying that she should be fired, you know, and, and, um, just uh, really angry on the Sean Hannity show recently, and uh, and then she 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 calls uh, uh, this spokesman for Romney a moron, and you know, and and the going into her her uh, her name calling, which is something I'm trying to teach my teenager not to do, is name calling. Here she is making a name for herself and her quote unquote beauty or whatever, and her her charisma and her self righteousness and her her intellectualism and uh, it's it's all a bunch of garbage. So um, Ann Coulter, not my favorite person, and uh, she's behaving like uh, you know, where parents should be cringing at uh, at the name calling and the antics that she that she does. Uh, she's not a good role model, and she's really a pernicious force in politics. A very very dangerous, very dangerous person. So there we go. So, uh, you know, if Pat Condell sees this video, maybe he can talk about Ann Coulter. Wouldn't that be fun? So have a great day, everybody. And uh, this is uh, the JFA signing out.